Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Subdazer here with a new video of new game. So this game is called Best Friends Forever. So I'm going to talk about this game, and I'm going to tell you almost everything that you need to know about it if you are playing it. So I hope you all playing. You are all playing this game because it's really, really addicted. I'm, I started playing it from yesterday, and I can't really stop playing it. So yeah. So as you can see in here, I'm stage 90 out of 105, but this is my second ward. So the first ward I completed 80 and then I used the portal. So in here, I'm going to show you how to get a free gems fast. So what I basically do in order to get free gems. So I basically use, uh, I basically go, you know, where it's like here and the down in the left side, you go for it to see the wards. So you can basically see beside the portal thing like the social media of the game. You can basically go ahead and follow them but what I did is be, is clicking on them and then leave the app because they open like YouTube to go subscribe just leaving it and they count as subscribing and the same thing goes for following on Snapchat and Instagram so the only thing that you need to follow them for real is uh, uh, Twitter so the Twitter thing is you need to follow them. And the second thing is basically what I do is completing quests or missions so or achievements because in here you get you basically get the uh, you ba you really get a uh, reward in completing achievements as gems so the gems you need them really to buy good things I think the easiest thing to complete stages is with having gems because you can buy go you can buy coins quickly and yeah so this basically how to get gems it's really not that hard so let me tell you about the portal so now i i wore to uh, clear stages 90 out of 100 out of 405 so probably i'll try my best to complete each war totally completed so welcome to war three and so uh, the the portal is making your player stronger so what do i mean so here's the stage one look at the damage i'm completing it like quickly so here i completed an achievement and i got the gems so i need like 150 gem to buy a really good item uh, to buy the gold the coins quickly and in order to level up fast okay so those are the challenges that i need to complete so this is the easiest and the fastest way to get in the game in the game uh, to get uh, the free gems i believe and so let me tell you about the portal so you need to go to it you need to use the portal in order to be stronger and to complete stages even faster so now as you can see in here i'm stage i completed a stage uh, seven stages now i'm stage nine so yeah so i need one more achieve one more challenge to do i'm not pretty sure what's that about so let me go here and here as you can see I have 353 like portal points I can call and I buy equipment so I can choose maybe coin magnet I'll probably choose the coin magnet because it's uh, really the game is basically all about gaining coins to get even higher so I can upgrade those so upgrade the friend damage by 610% now coins plus 150 yeah, 150 so oh that's is, this is the challenge okay so basically the portal is making you f stronger so you tap quickly and you can kill like the boss itself is being killed by one damage so if you're going to ask me should you use the portal or should you complete first the whole stages i would say if you want to complete the game faster you i think go for the portal because the stronger you are, the faster you can complete the game. Then I believe you can go back to the wards, to the different ward that you really wanted to complete. So yeah, this is this goes for the portal thing. It's it's really powering your friends and making even your players stronger. So okay, now I'm going to talk about what to upgrade first. So. In terms of the friends or the tapping or maybe you can call it slap so I would say go upgrading slap because here you can see slap now is in good uh, status so uh, after a while it will be like weak like yesterday I got it like very weak so if I upgrade the thing the hand thing so if I upgrade it 
it will change the statue to be like from very weak to weak then from weak to uh, to okay then good and then it will be good so it keeps changes so i would say go ahead and upgrade this so what i do basically is upgrading them like all my friends i want to be sure they are at level 10 so this is what i do now and then i will upgrade my so now as you can see here the slap is weak then I go for this lap, so now it's in a good statue. So now it's in an even better, uh, it's in slap testic, so slap testic. Even like really a lot of damage as you can see in here. So yeah, this is basically what you all, what you need uh, to know about uh, Best Friends Forever. It's really addictive game, I can't really stop playing it. Tell me if you are playing it, tell me which stage are you, I'm really curious about that. And yeah, that's it for this video guys, I hope you enjoyed watching, don't forget to comment, like and subscribe for more, if you want me to do more of this, uh, more of best friends, for, uh, more of best uh, friends forever, I would uh, probably do if you want me to do more. So yeah, that's it for this video guys, let's try to reach uh, 50 likes for this video, and like this video if you enjoyed, dislike if you didn't. I hope you enjoyed watching, so let's try to reach 50 plus likes, and... So yeah, there are 15 wards in here. That's amazing. So yeah, that's it again for this video. Goodbye and see you later, guys.